-hmm. If you tell me something, I need your actions to back it up. Bam. See, that's why. Now that we talking, like, now that we talking. Hello, my loves, and welcome back to Simply Bria Bria. It's your girl Jabria here, y'all, and I'm back with another video. So I don't know if you guys saw it, but I did um, start kind of like a series on my channel titled, oh, who is this on this video? Titled Real Raw and Unedited. So this is going to be episode two, and I'm bringing a guest on, which he can introduce himself, and he's ready. You're talking for me. No, come on. I don't like introducing <clears throat> This is my lovely, lovely, lovely brother, Juwan. Um, <laughs> I'll leave his information stuff down below and on the screen or whatever. But yeah, he'll be our featured guest, y'all. So let's get to it. So this is basically just going to be surrounding relationships and different things like that. So I'm not going to be too long. I'm going to hop right in. But before we do, please do not forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And share the video with people that you think may be interested as well. So yeah, let's hop into it. The first question is, do do you believe girls and guys can just be best friends and not have anything extra going on? But wait, before you get your answer, which you kind of already did, I did ask Instagram, my Instagram page. Um, I'll plug the results right here. Also, follow me on Instagram. Um, so, basically, the people said, this is what the people said. What they said? 87% said yes, 13% <coughs> said no. And it's kind of hard to judge how many women, how many men, because a lot of people participated, okay? But yeah, that's basically what they said. And I asked why, and okay, somebody said two words, brown sugar. If it weren't a girl or that close, they just need to be together. <laughs> okay. Somebody else said, I have a guy best friend, basically, and nothing's ever happened. <coughs> Another person said, I have two guy best friends, I see them as brothers. I got a boy best friend I never touched nor like thought about it and vice versa. The vice versa is important. And that's pretty much what people's explanation was. So now we're going to ask Juwan, what does he think about the question? Can you be best friends with the opposite? Can I be sex? <clears throat> Me? Yeah, I can. <laughs> but I mean, it just, you want to start lying. It just, it just <laughs> depends. What does it depend on? The other person. You think and it depends the on the female? It depends on both of them. Okay. Okay. What else? That's it. So have you experienced anything with like you being a best friend with somebody? Being a best friend with a girl? And um, how did that turn out? If so. I got a best friend. <laughs> <laughs> I can't stay nah, out here. It just depends on. Really? I think I think yes I think so too I think you can just be best friends with opposite sex um what was I gonna say oh, oh but I think it definitely depends on the person some people are not able to keep that boundary and usually not to throw any shade whatsoever but usually it, usually <laughs> it's the man that cannot keep that boundary usually I from my perspective that's what I think what do you what think? Do you, think? do you feel like if it doesn't work, whose fault do you it think gotta be the girl. It don't got to be nothing. got to be. No. Okay. Let's add, be add realistic. Instagram. Instagram said they never had no issues with it being. Well, ask the ones who said if it asked the 13%. <laughs> they didn't explain why. They don't want to. Because it's probably them. Never. The man. Never. Anyways, y'all. I... Usually, because men are more like pushy and like I don't know. I just feel like if anything in that situation is probably the man that wants something more. I just feel like that. Y'all, let me know what y'all feel, cause that's just how I feel. Like, okay, let's jump into the next question. So, oh, dating outside of your race, fifty-four percent. Y'all, this is funny. Fifty-four percent said yes. Forty-six percent said no. Let me, some of the stuff I can't read y'all because, yeah, the people. Yeah, I read it. I, oh, one, I one, one person really, had. Really not Yeah, but some stuff, you know. <laughs> really not <uncut. laughs> Anyway, so somebody said, I don't want to have to explain my culture to anyone. And I can definitely get her point because certain people, you know, we grow up differently. We live differently. They're not going to understand exactly 
You know what I'm saying? <laughs> just small stuff like why do you season your food that much? Just small stuff they may not understand. Why do y'all have family reunions every year? Like they may not understand. You know what I'm saying? That's so minor, but it's really part of who we are. I know my food got to be seen. <laughs> <laughs> Anyway, somebody else said, why not? I'm just not finna do it. <laughs> yeah, it's really personal preference, honestly. Somebody else said, I love my black queens, but I'll date whoever makes me happy. <laughs> there you have it. That's what he like, black people, <coughs> black women. But whoever make him happy, ultimately. Somebody else just said she'll take a strong black one. Okay, strong black man. <laughs> I can't say that. Basically, he's saying like other, um, some other races are like a little bit crazier than others. So he's gonna stick with the black queens. If that's your thing, go for it. But personally, I need chocolate ba babies like me. <laughs> so she's basically saying, yeah, like that's not her thing. Gotta be able to relate to me. Okay, so not necessarily against dating outside your race, but just that person has to be able to relate. When you gonna get to me? I'm gonna get to you. Okay. We don't discriminate, but I I ain't say I wanna marry a black woman. I ain't say I ain't, I don't know what he's trying to say. He put too he many ain'ts in there. Basically he's saying he don't discriminate, but he's not saying that he doesn't want to marry a black woman. So he don't discriminate, so he may date them, but ultimately he wants to marry a black woman. I'm not attracted to any other race of man besides black men. That's the only reason. Period. Okay. So, from what it seems like, a lot of people don't really mind if you date outside your race, but personally for them, that's just not what they're into. <clears throat> how do you feel, sir? Tell the people how do you feel. I want to know, too. I want to know. I'm trying you to You made a question again? Do you date outside your race? How do you feel about it? No, I don't date outside my race. Do you think, like, how do you feel about it? Like, I don't know, just in general. <laughs> people do it. You dated outside of your race? They may have been mixed, but like, does that count technically? Mixed like, different. That means you got a little bit of me in you. Okay. So you wouldn't date outside your race? Yeah, I ain't with it. At all. Have you ever dated outside your race? Think about it. Think about it. <laughs> <laughs> think about I don't know. I don't know. I think you have. And if you can't find the person who you're talking about, I don't know. I think you have, but I think it was high school is what I'm recalling. High school. High school. Crazy. We remember. You don't know what I remember. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know nothing. Anyways. But yeah, that's not my preference. Yeah, I think it all boils down to what your preference is. Like me personally, I don't care what other people do. If you want to date outside your race, cool. Like. I'm not pressed because then you just you wasn't gonna be for me anyway so I'm not pressed personally I wouldn't do it because that's not attractive to me I know you like the braids little braids shiny anyway I'm just not attracted to like people outside of the black community you know what I'm saying so like I personally wouldn't but I, like I always say in my videos like do you like if that's what you want to do do you? It don't bother. It ain't got nothing to do with me. It don't bother me. See, that's how I feel. So, any last comments on that? Um. Period. Okay. The next question is, what makes a person relationship material to you? We can start with you. This nah, time. let's start with the people. Let's start with you. Because the people <laughs> is what, what comes first. Okay, I'm going to just do one. So, somebody said, loyalty before all. Everything else will fall fall into place with that and that's so true because if you're not loyal we would never i'm talking about never work like you're not even mine at this point you you for everybody like uh what's that song i don't know you know he was asking the people. they for everybody cash doll cash doll mm -hmm. they for everybody so that's what we're saying okay. how do you feel i thought we was going by the people okay you the people too you're the guest I'm last. Anyway, somebody else said unconditional love, trust, patience, and growth. Well said. Well said, my sis. Somebody else said gotta have ambition. <laughs> I ain't messing with somebody that settles. That's so true. That's so true. We can't be <clears throat> same love our whole life. Like, what are we doing here? And that was all the people said on that one. So, basically, what makes a person relationship material to you? Are you asking me? Mm 
Um, how about you go first? How about you go? <laughs> I'm gonna be. What did? Uh, what did he say? First leg. Last, last first. Leg. <laughs> okay, I can't okay. think of his name. Cat, Cat Williams. Williams. Okay. Yeah. So, um, ask question one more time. What makes a person relationship material to you? Uh, like you could be talking to ten girls, but what would be that? What's one quality or whatever that one girl would well, have? Well, first let me stop you there because ten is too many. Okay, That's five. Let's near down five. To five is too many. It's nothing wrong with five. But um, <clears throat> it's nothing wrong. Um, with me, I would just say keep your word. I would. <laughs> <laughs> nah, for you, uh. Bro, I can't stand keep you. Keep your word. So basically, trustworthy, loyal. Loyal to like the, like the person said. Or what she say? Uh, basically having. Well, somebody said having loyalty. Everything loyalty. else will follow. Everything. Yeah, and then somebody else said like trustworthy and all of that. Trustworthy. Mhm. Mm I definitely keep your word. Yeah, be I think. You. What else would they be? Like fake? Or are you saying somebody on TV? Okay, so like. Yeah. Being fake, yeah. in a sense. So, I don't know. I never really thought about this question, honestly. Um, but what would make? <laughs> I mean, I've never been in relationships, so I don't really know. Obviously, they didn't have the qualities because I'm not in a relationship. We're talking about what is is. That's what I'm trying to. to well, yeah, that's what I'm trying to see. What would be relationship material to me? I feel like. I think it's like, yeah, just being like honest, like being honest. I'm looking everywhere else. Mm -hmm. Honest to me. <laughs> <laughs> Baby, look, these number 30. If you're looking for it, I'll link it. Okay. But yeah, I feel like um, what would make a person relationship material to me? I Just being like honest and trustworthy, like, and being off, like, I need you all for me. I don't want you half for me, half for someone else. Check it out. I don't want you half for me, half for somebody else. Like that's too much sharing. I don't want to share my man. I don't want to. I don't want to share nothing. You know what I'm saying? So I feel like for me, yeah, just being upfront. And if you tell me something, oh, that's another thing. If you tell me something, that's not like what you're saying. Mm -hmm. If you tell me something, I need your actions to back it up. Bam. See, that's why. Now that we talking, like now that we talking, I hate inconsistency. So if you're saying you want someone and you're not being consistent with that person, you don't want them, which is cool. Or you don't want them in that serious way like you thought. Yeah. Which is cool. So like for you to be relationship material, you gotta be consistent. Can't be just switching it up. I was watching one video and it was like a dude panel and she was saying something uh -huh. and it was like guys, like a dude panel and she was asking a dude's question. Oh. Man, I'm sorry, young man. So yeah, and one of the guys was like, um, you can't, that's rude. You can't, um, you can't start something with women because then they're going to be expecting it. So he was like, I don't text my, I don't text girls all day because then one day if I'm not busy or something, I don't text back. They're going to be like, why are you switching up? Why are you changing up? But it's like, that you're not being thing. consistent. If you're going to be consistently a trash dude, at least be consistently trash. You know what I'm saying? At least you're not starting off good then going to trash. So she already knew what it was up front. You know what I'm saying? But like, that switching up, I just don't like that. I really don't. And that's how I feel about that. I went on a little rant, but. You did. <laughs> Cause I can't stand that. That's like, why you away. I can't stand that. Like, being consistent. I think that, to me, that's even more, well, definitely trustworthy and all that. But being consistent is definitely, definitely. Yeah. Keeping your words out with me. For sure. Being on, but that's kind of like certain stuff is kind of like. I ain't talking about the honesty. I'm talking about keeping your word. That's kind of well. That's kind of the same. Being truthful, right? I'm trying keeping to think, but like all of this, all of this, you would think a person would naturally do. People not like us, but yeah, you would think they would naturally. Okay, so last question. I don't know how I'm recording. Do y'all think everybody cheat? Why we look like we the same color? We are the same color. You got the magical one. Baby, we're not the same Baby, I'm chocolate and I'm not a person. And I'm caramel. Anyways, back to it. Do we look alike, y'all? Oh, my life, we don't. Let me see. No. We look alike. No. 
They back used to, up. You y'all, they like, used to, She catfish, y'all, back up. They know how I look, uh, y'all. <laughs> <laughs> y'all, people used to think we was, people used to think we was twins growing up. They were like, are you older? Asking me, are you older? I'm like, no, he's two years old. I thought old. we was doing the video. I'm just letting them know we used to be twins. Okay, anyway, so do I ask, do you think everybody cheats? 26% said yes, 74% said no. And y'all, a lot of people participated in these polls, so shout out to y'all that participated. But yeah, so the majority of people said no, they do not think everybody cheat. I don't know, let me wait, hold on, let me go. You wanna say something, or you want me to go I'm say something? I'm gonna wait, you know I'm wait. Okay, so people said, <laughs> basically one person said she knows what she has, or she knows what basically like she can bring to the table so you know what I'm saying it ain't no it ain't no big deal does he mean in their own ways he said I'm their own ways probably in their own ways that would make the most sense so I guess he's saying people cheat in their own ways which is kind of true because well we can go back into like what is cheating to you we can go back to that but just answer do you think everybody cheat who me Yes. I thought we was asking people. Yeah, we did. Okay. Well, um. <clears throat> Let me hold this. Um. Well, I think I feel like yeah. I don't trust. Yeah. You don't trust what? You don't trust these. No, that's <laughs> not what we're gonna say. He doesn't trust these yeah, women. Yeah, these women. Young ladies. Because women, women just lie so much. You just <laughs> bring it back, bring it back. Now you ask me the question, let me ask. I just want you to make sure you watch what you say. Yeah. Choose your um, life. Yeah, you know, it's 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 a lot to get somebody's trust. But off the back, you can't trust. So you think it's only the women that's lying and cheating? Mostly, I would say if I had to do like a, a percentage, my percentage. Yeah. My percentage. Your percentage? Should be, um, from women to men, Excuse I would, me. I say probably, not to boost it, then probably 95 to five. That's just my percentage. I could be wrong. You you can be way but, wrong. Um, <laughs> At this point, you can be way wrong. Yeah, all I'm saying is uh, men out there, to my men, to my fellows, you gotta watch these girls. They, they don't. Lady. Hold on, let me tell you. You asked me the question, let me tell you. <laughs> you gotta watch them. That's all I'm saying. And if you gotta watch them too hard, cut them off. That's how I'm done with that. Well, for you to say that you feel like ninety-five to five. No, you said you said everybody cheat, right? You think everybody cheat? I didn't say everybody. I said most women. I thought when I asked the question, what did, what was the exact question? That I asked? Give me the question, guys. I Let's like go back. Question. Let's go back, cause I think. Do you think everybody cheats? Oh, the question. um, not everybody. Okay, because then I was saying you're including yourself. And I agree with everybody. whoever said in their own way, because, yeah. Anyway, so my take on it, I don't think everybody cheat. I think in this world, majority of the people cheat. It's a lot of cheaters. I do think so, because, I don't know, like, it's just, first of all, it's so easy to meet people to cheat, if that makes sense, to fall into cheating. Mm -hmm. So, like more places to go instagram like social media in general is so easy to meet people and to cheat so quote unquote jabria i've never cheated i've never been with anybody to cheat jabria. anyway have i your, cheated your guest has a question for you what is the question what is she this conversation with another person oh, that was it that's what we're gonna ask i feel like for me cheating is if i do anything first i wouldn't want my partner doing or that I would feel some type of way if my partner find out. So that, to me, that's just like the intentions behind what you do. So for example, liking somebody picture, to me, it's not it's not nothing like that. If I know like, oh, I'm just liking their picture. Oh, like we're cool, we've been cool. I've always liked their picture. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. But like, like I said, the intentions behind something. So like if I know, oh, I'm liking his picture to try to catch his attention. So I'm gonna like a few of his pictures that's different. You get what I'm saying? To me, that's cheating. Even if your partner doesn't recognize it, it's your intentions behind it. If that makes sense. So, yeah. I don't know, but cheating can be anything like flirting. Anything that you wouldn't want your partner doing 
or you wouldn't be okay if your partner was right there seeing you doing it. Cheat. Mm -hmm. Okay. So everybody, um, Okay, well, I, I, I got Not it. Not morals, but everybody's standards and stuff are different with that, but, like, okay. that's how my, my take on it. Okay. What do you say? What is cheating to you? Cheating to me? I don't I agree with you. Don't agree. <laughs> <laughs> Look, come on with your own. Nah, I agree with you, but, um. Um, what do you think cheating is to you? What is cheating um, to you? Cheating can be communication what you mean like communicating with somebody else talking to too many talking too much it's cheating like talking too much to other people to other people is cheating why would they be talking to other people that's what i'm trying to see or you mean like just like friends too many friends that's cheating that's not because now you too friendly wait wait a second yes, yes. if you if they was friends before y'all met then there's what is it i'm not understanding i'm just saying Talking to too many people is cheating. <laughs> um, if they're friends, that's different. Now, if they're crossing boundaries with friends, thank you. That's I just that can be cheating. Go into detail, but okay, go into detail because the people need to know exactly. The how people you feel. gonna already know what I'm coming from. The people, the people need to know. But yeah, too much communication with other outside people. Um, what cheating. <laughs> cheating can be looking at somebody too hard. That's cheating. But see, it all goes back to what the person said on the thing. I need to shut them up. Whoever said it in their own ways, I like that. Yeah, because everybody has their own sign to flirt with people, basically. Basically, like you, you stare down people when you're what flirting. Are you talking about? I'm just saying everybody has their own way to like get I, that person's attention. I get stared down. I just be trying to make sure everything okay. Are we done lying? <laughs> Why are we talking about me and we supposed Anyways, to Anyways, back to it. Because you be just talking. Okay, back to it. I'm done, done. Be, so uh, you think, what is, so communicating with too many people is cheating? Too much communication. Um, what else I said? Looking at, that's. Oh, looking at them too long. That's, that's, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Look, this sounds yeah. like you have a direct example. No. <laughs> I don't know what you're talking about. But, um. What else? Have you ever cheated on anyone? <laughs> this is you too. <laughs> <laughs> what are you talking about? I'm just asking, have you ever cheated while you were with someone? Um. With, not talking to. Because I feel like if you're just talking to the person, I mean, you're not with them. Okay, well. Any I, age. I feel like, um. In a sense, I have because I have lived too long. <laughs> <laughs> but not Asian, bro. You already said it, Bookie. Say it. Yeah. You look too long. I look too long, so if that's considered in other people's eyes, then. Yeah, because you said in your eyes, that's considered. So in my eyes, I have. Okay. What else have you done? That's it. What else have you done? Um, that's it. <laughs> <laughs> Lying. What do you think? What do I think? What would? About, I already answered. Um, what do you think she means? I already answered it. You did? Yeah, I said basically like if you do anything that you wouldn't want your partner to see it. And that was a good one. I, I agree. Yeah, with that. like that could be anything. So for example, if he see you looking down somebody, that's disrespectful. That may be fuzz. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but um. But yeah, that really sums up because, like I said, it could be anything. It could be. Yeah. Liking too many people pick that's too, another thing. So do you likes. think yeah, do you think um yeah. do would you have an issue with your partner? Yeah, yeah. Your significant other liking other people pictures. Yeah, yeah. Ain't no likes going on. Okay, but do you like other people pictures? My partners. Okay, would you like other girls' pictures if you're in a relationship? My partners. Okay, so you don't see our anything partners. wrong. If it's our or partners. you see something wrong. Yeah. Oh, liking people pictures and cheating. Yeah. So you feel like if your significant other likes somebody else's pictures, that's cheating. What do you think about it? Depending on who it is, mm -hmm. how many pictures they like, mm -hmm. and if they liking, 
and going on their page that's cheating. But if you just like them, just be like, and when you like, see I, it, show, I show a little bit. Again, okay, so the intentions behind it. Showing love and liking pictures is two different things. That's so true. And so, like, just to speak on that. So, for example, there are same people that I follow that anytime they post a picture, I'm going to like it. Why is that? Like, if they're my best friends, like oh. my girlfriends, or oh. if they're like, like my girlfriend, like my friends. Oh, okay. Or if they're like, for example, like, I don't know, somebody we went to school with. Say, and it's like, say it's my picture. I might, well, you're my brother. That's different. Like, okay. like what? But like, if there's somebody that I went to school with and we were just cool, like, I'm automatically liking pictures. I don't even look at the pictures all the way. Like, my friends, I like the pictures before I even, like, swipe to look. So, you get what I'm saying? So, to, so, like, but I'm saying some people are not friendly even with liking people pictures. So would you say that you be liking people pictures but you don't like the picture? I'm saying is I'm if there I'm like, saying do you like people pictures just cause or <laughs> do you be like liking their picture or do you just like it just cause Well if it's my friend, yeah of course I'm gonna be like, oh like if it's what a girl What if you actually didn't like the picture? I'm still like it. I'm okay. not gonna hold you. Okay. I'm not gonna with you. But like also to me too, like I've always been a picture like it. Like I like everybody's pictures. Like if I don't know them though and it's a dude and I don't like his picture, I'm not gonna like it. Does that make sense? Mm -mm. But my friends, I don't necessarily have to like whatever the picture is, but I'm you just gonna like it. Shall yeah. Okay. And so not that I would I never really just not liked it because if yeah. they're my friends and I already like them. So yeah. I'm but, talking about like it's a bad picture or something. Yeah, but my friends are all cute, so it's like I don't really have that issue. All my <laughs> girlfriends bad. Now, if it's a, like a dude picture, then I'm not gonna look that hard. First of all, he's just my friend, but I'm gonna like it and keep scrolling. Keep scrolling. That's what I'm. Gonna but do. again, like if you're not first of all, if you're not a person to like pictures in general, and so you go out of your way to yeah. like the opposite sex picture, then that's where it's like, mm -hmm. are you trying to slap me in my face? It's like, what are we doing? Especially like he said, if you like go on their page and like like three in a row, and they're not even recent, it's like all right. That's how you try to get somebody's attention. So yes, that would be an issue. That would be a huge issue, and that'll be cheating. They be doing that super. Well, I'm not in a relationship. I'm saying do they be going to your page like in two pictures? Oh yeah. Who? For sure. For sure. They know who they are. <laughs> Shut them up. No, we're not calling. It's too many. We're not calling about that. Anyway, but I'm just saying, but that's how you get somebody's attention. So if you're doing that in a relationship, you're trying to get the other person's attention. And that's cheating. Cheating. That's one reason why in this world, I feel like it's so easy in this, not world, in this, what am I trying to Generation. say? Generation. Generation, thank you. It is so easy to get caught up with cheating. Like the dude said, in their own way. It's so easy to get caught up. I don't trust you. <laughs> you don't trust them? Well, we don't trust song. these. It's a song. It's a song. Fill in the blank. But yeah, so did you have anything else to touch on with any of the topics we covered? Um, Cheating, dating outside your race, relationship material, any no, of that? No, but I have a, I have a, I have a, um, what's it called? A question? No, I have a, um, a comment. Oh, yeah. I like this little video that you made, Bri. So y'all let me know if y'all want him to come back. Leave it down below in the comment section and we can do a part, well, it'll be a part two, but it'll be episode three. And yeah, if y'all have any um, suggestions on other topics we should talk about, or if you guys want to give scenarios or something that you're dealing with, whatever that you dealt with, leave it down below, and we can definitely feature it in the next video. You call me Dr. Phil. Okay. <laughs> They're going to call him Dr. Sit Down somewhere. But yeah, so I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, please do not forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Share the video, you guys. Let's run it up. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye. I love you all. You can't lean back, though. Because it looks bad on camera. Okay. Right here. <laughs> this is what we have to pause for. Yeah. They popping at your, popping at your shirt. Mama, get off Facebook. Mama, can you tell them put the phone down and we're trying to do a whole video? My bad.